it was fine. Lit, so, I was never a super healthy kid. I was always the one who was sick. I mean, I didn't learn how to ride a bike till I was like eight, maybe. It took forever, because I was never super athletic or healthy. But when I was seven or eight, I had, like my, I first started experiencing symptoms of arthritis. And then when I was nine, I was finally diagnosed. And at first I didn't really know what it meant. I was just, it was just sort of like, oh wow, this is a thing, we're gonna fix it. It's great, we know what's wrong with me now. And then, I guess as I sort of started to realize like, oh, this is like a lifelong rest of ever thing. I was just, I did not know how to handle it. I mean, I had like all of the big dreams and I was gonna be on Broadway and I was gonna be a gymnast. I never took one gym class ever, but I was gonna be an Olympic gymnast, by golly. <laughs> and so, before, in the space in between diagnosis and camp, I didn't know how I was gonna do anything. I didn't know what life was going to look like. I just sort of fell apart a little bit. And we went to camp, and for the first time since I was like, oh, this isn't going away, I was like, I can be a normal person. I can do all of the things. I can learn how to play ukulele and zip line and paint. And there's a way to hold a paintbrush that I hadn't thought of because my hands didn't work right. So it brought back, it helped me realize that I could still completely follow my dreams. I just had to find a new way to do it. Okay.